Hey Family in Christ, I want to talk to you today about something that I've been thinking about as it pertains to what is our purpose on this earth and how do we make sure that the good deeds we do on this earth actually matter. So here is essentially the thought. Is what you are doing on this earth, is that going to matter in a hundred billion years? Now, it's kind of a big, kind of dumb number, right? A hundred billion, who thinks that far ahead? But the reality is, is that for us believers, we are going to be in heaven for an eternity. We see our purpose here on earth in passages like Romans 6. In Romans 6, starting in verse 12, it says, Let not sin therefore reign in your mortal body to make you obey its passions. Do not present your members to sin as instruments for unrighteousness, but present yourselves to God as those who have been brought from death to life and your members to God as instruments for righteousness. Furthermore, in Colossians 3.17, it says, And whatever you do in word or deed, do all in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ, giving thanks to God the Father through him. Let me give you sort of a topical example. There's great injustices happening in the world today, and many of us are being called to go to peaceful protests. What is your end goal in attending something like a peaceful protest? Is your end goal to see the betterment of America and this earth that we have right now? Is that the end goal? And once that happens, you are satisfied with your work. If your end goal is to bring temporary change to this earthly kingdom, I promise you, in a hundred billion years, it's not going to matter. But if your end goal is to see God glorified through your actions and see his righteousness reflected and shown to those who know him and who don't know him, that will matter. I'm asking myself, is, is the attitude that I'm bringing and the perspective that I'm bringing, is it going to make a difference today and that's it? Is it going to make a difference for the next hundred years and that's it? Or is it going to make a difference in eternity where in a hundred billion years I am still receiving and seeing the effects because I went into that opportunity to serve others with the perspective that I am a tool for God's righteousness and that in everything I do in word or deed, I am doing in the name of the Lord Jesus, giving thanks to the Father through him. My prayer for you is that you adopt this perspective, that in whatever we do in word or deed, we want that to last for a hundred billion years, for a zillion years, for all of eternity. And we are doing good deeds and righteous deeds in order to glorify Him and to change eternity? Then we are truly living Shema.